everyone and welcome to Norris Cove or welcome back. I'm Yoshida and here at the Cove we do budgeting, finances, business, minimal and functional planning. But today we're going to be doing a cash stuffing for our budget for the week of April the 3rd through the... Somebody help me out. <laughs> I'm not looking at a calendar. But anywho, here we are back in the wallet. It's time for a new wallet, but hey, um, let's see what we got going on. Y'all would have had more. Took a trip to Target, so that kind of threw me off a little bit, but it's okay. Uh, let's see. We're going to take money from Hubby. And we're going to add that here. We're going to take um, Garden. We're not stuffing Garden uh, this week. Gas. I had to get gas. I have to get premium, so it was $65, then I had to make an unexpected trip um, out of town quickly and back, so that took up a lot of my gas. So I'm going to put this in, I was going to try to let it build up, but I'm going to repay myself. That'll kind of, I didn't want to use it at the Target, so that'll just kind of bring me back. <laughs> I'm going to put this back in the bank um, tomorrow, which is Monday. I'm actually a day behind. See, if I did this cash stuff and target with the one okay so let's count and see how much we have to stuff but i was determined and we're gonna get it done so let's see we have 50 120 40 60 70 80 85 90 95 100 5 10 15 20 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, and 27. So we should have 127. Let me count that again. We have $227. I'm not going to pull out my tray, y'all, because I'm working on something for the budget box and it is taking up a lot of room on my desk. I want to have my binders here in front of me as well. Okay, so back to the envelope. Today, I have my little um, cheat sheet here. We're going to be stuffing eating out. I did really good with eating out last week. Um, let me get a two, twenties, and a five. I did really, really good with that because uh, I think I'm going to do a ten. I stuck to that, only ate out twice, kind of, I think, last week, when normally it's an everyday thing. Some days I just came home, had a peanut butter jelly sandwich because I knew what my goals were. Okay, so we're done with this one, and we transferred the 30 to the bank. So that's all that's going in the wallet today. Um, I do realize I need to save for Christmas, but I'm going to wait because I'm heavily trying to fund my one month ahead. Okay, so uh, next we're going to do the 52-week challenge. I realized I kind of had this high one in my, um, it's a 5K 52-week challenge. That's what I was trying to do, and I really could dip, do it, but I changed my mind. I'm just going to do the regular one. I'm going to print out the form, but basically I need $78, and I think I need to catch up. Let me see. We're on week 13. Yeah, it would be $91. So we're going to put $78, and I'll try to catch up during the week. So we got $50, $70, So we're going to put $78 in, and somehow during the week, I'll catch up. So I'm not going to do this 5K one. Um, if I have extra, I'll do that. And I think this is just the easiest one because the highest number is $52. Okay. So we took care of that. Again, I want to do Christmas. We're going to do the one in five challenge. I'm going to wait on Christmas savings. I'm saving digitally. Um, all this stuff is digitally, but for that moment, besides Christmas and the one in five challenge, we're going to do a five. Okay. So we're done with this binder. Um, business, um, I'll be getting paid, <sighs> but I need to like kind of pay myself back 
for some things I've bought for the box, but I definitely want to do that and we'll do that off, not off camera, but we'll do that um, once I'm paid from Shopify. So next up, we're going to go in this binder, with it, which is my month ahead binder. And I'm also going to show y'all something that I'm, one second. So let's get to one month ahead. And one month ahead, we are putting $55 in. $55. Let's see what we got. Twenty, thirty, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, fifty, and ninety. Oh, a hundred. Sorry. Let me line these up correctly. So, okay. Now let's make sure. Fifty, seventy, eighty, ninety, ninety-five, ninety-six, ninety-seven, ninety-eight, ninety-nine, a hundred. We have reached a hundred. I was going for 4000 but I'm going to show you what I plan to do. I decided to do um, after watching some more Get Ahead videos. In our January box, they got a wallet and some of these clear envelopes. When I had this idea, I just thought these could go here, which they do fit, but it is a very tight squeeze. Anywho, one of my subs suggested just laying it in, so that's what I'm going to do. But once I get to a certain amount, um, here I have my car listed. I don't know if you can see. I have T-Mobile. These are like my main big things. Car insurance, credit cards, bills, and business. And so, <clears throat> for my business is mainly shipping or something like that. Um, and products. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to try to knock out car first from that T-Mobile, fund that car insurance, fund that credit cards, all that, and put it here. And I've just kind of decorated the wallet. You know, I will sometimes give my stuff away, and I really thought I had given mine away, and I said, no, I don't think I gave it away. So I decided, hey, I got to keep my copy. So I'll have this. This is going to be like in my little, kind of like my Bill's uh, wallet. <clears throat> so we've funded month ahead. We funded one in five, and actually one in five, so we've been getting nine. So I need to go back to one in five, and it gets four. One, two, three, four. And I'm not counting what's in my one in fives, just stuffing. So I'm doing two challenges at the moment. I'm doing the one in five. All these probably won't end to the end of the year. Okay. And then I think what I'm going to do for the one and five is like during the week when I get ones and fives, I'm just going to stick them in there. They don't necessarily always have to be on camera. Uh, so we got some money left here. We have, oh, <clears throat> we gave 78 to the 52 week challenge. Month ahead got 55. Why do we have this money left over? Why do I have this money left over? Okay, y'all. So. I don't know where the miscalculation came in. Maybe I'll catch it on editing. Um, I do need some nail supplies, so I'm going to put five in nail supplies. Um, but it just really has to build up because the monomer that I use, it's about $80. And then plus shipping. <clears throat> and by it being a liquid, it is more. Also this week, I got household stuff, so I'm not going to fill that one up. Um, Bentley, they're good. Hubby, that so... We're good in this binder here. Um, maybe I'll do taxes. And the other day, I needed like $24 in taxes. But what I'm going to do, because I'm going to still add to the taxes um, this week when I get paid. So I'm just going to come over here to taxes. I'll put that there. Yeah, I don't know where I went wrong. Shipping. Um, I'm trying to um, <clears throat> do my good standing, and I think it's $300. Um, I'm going to put five in here. So every year you have to pay a good standing fee, which I clearly overlooked. Um, yeah. So we're going to do that, and then I think I'm going to take this 10, and I'm going to put that... Here's that wallet. It's going in the month ahead fund. 
But like I said, I want to knock down car first. Some people like to lock, knock down the smallest first. I want to knock down the biggest. Like, I want to get that one over with. So we're just going to um, add 10 to car. You know what? I put these on backwards. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, well, it's okay. I can always switch them around. And then I got another 10, and I'm just going to, let's see. I think I'm going to put that in Christmas, so we'll be ahead in Christmas. Okay, so, you know what? Uh, I'm not going to put it in debt. Nope. Since I'm behind, let me put the 10 in a 52-week challenge. Matter of fact, yeah. So we should have, let's see, 50, 70, 75, 80, 85, 86, 87, 88. So we're like maybe $10 short or something like that. So we'll just catch up with that. So that'll be in our 52 week challenge. And we got money in the one and five. We put a pretty good amount in there. I mean, I could have put it in Christmas, but I think I'm going to start Christmas next week. All of our binders have been filled, even the business binder, even though. So I should be doing another cash stuff in possibly Tuesday or Wednesday and that's it y'all thank you again so much for watching if you enjoyed today's video and you would love to see more videos like this for myself do me a favor hit that subscribe button also hit that notification bell and I'll see you guys in the next video bye